We had this crazy idea of uh, creating a music festival in our hometown. Uh, we were tired of going to Montreal each time. Uh, at some point, we, we said to ourselves, uh, we should start something, like, just for us. I had never heard of Roaring Aranda before. They were like, oh, okay, it's a festival kind of like in this small town up north. And when we got there, it was this massive thing. It's amazing to see a whole city just get ready for so much music to come through. It's very exciting. It's a meeting of all these incredible new artists doing these new things that might not work unless you put it in that whole environment. It felt like better than any other festival we played. Like the town shut down for us. You know? <laughs> for me. For me, yeah. <laughs> There is an equal representation of Anglophone and Francophone music. That doesn't happen a lot, and we need more of that. I like coming to Quebec and seeing culture incarnate, and then as Indigenous people, we want our languages to be respected as well. And it's been amazing, like it is a mm -hmm. wicked party. The shows everywhere that are so different. It's one of the, the best kept secrets of uh, Quebec. Only in Quebec could this happen. Like, Quebec has an amazing music scene. <laughs> We've been trying to tell you that for like uh, 400 years, guys. But, you know, <laughs> it's about time, man. It's about time. <laughs>